Hi, welcome to this channel and you're here because you are pole dancer or you are about to learn pole dancing. Pole dance is a fantastic sports or artistic term that you can express anyway. Anyway, so talking blah blah blah, stop it. Subscribe to this channel if you're a pole dancer or you want to learn a pole dance. Weekly uploaded my pole dance related contents. And let's start this five minutes workout with Ellie. So let's get started. We are standing on the mat. We are going to spring and jump around. And shake your sh shoulders side to side. How are you, Ellie? I'm fine, I'm good. Yay. So then arm up. Feel free to move around. If you have knee problem, you can just lift your knee, or lift your heels like this. Okay, 10 more seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one, good job. So work around, nice and easy. Breathe naturally. So next thing, we're gonna fold forward. Try to extend your arm to the front. Feel the energy behind your leg. If you cannot reach the ground, don't worry. You can just extend your fingertips. So you must feeling behind your knee, feeling naturally breathing, tapping your fingertip on the floor, or you're completely on the floor. Whichever, any level, you are welcome to join this class. All right, and step forward. We're gonna move into downward facing dog. Inhale. Exhale. Stretch your arm, strong arm, push the hands. Bring your right leg all the way to the front. High wrench. Open your arm. Yes, very stable. And bring down your elbow. Let's do five times. Five, four, Three, two, one. Good job. And bring your opposite arm to the knee and twist. Looking over other side of the shoulder. Breathe in and breathe out. Slowly release your tension. Hands down to the floor. One more time. We're gonna do downward facing dog. Bring your left leg to the front. High wrench. Open your arm once more. Five times. Five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful. Hands down, sorry. <laughs> Hands on the knee and twist. Whew. Feeling energized, legs and shoulders, that's good. Slowly coming back to the middle and then drop the knees down to the floor. Try the pose, release any tension. Relax. Imagine you are like a chocolate and you're melting to the floor. Gently bringing up and coming into tabletop. So from here, we're gonna bring one side of the knee to the side. Hip straining. Try to maximize your contraction on the arms and abdominal. Let's do 10 more seconds, up and down. Do your own pace. How are you, Ellie? <laughs> 
You look great. <laughs> so five more seconds. Four, three, two, one, and switch side. Do you feel the hips? I feel the burn. Nice, firing up your hip. Let's do five more seconds. Four, three, two, one. Good job. Then we're gonna kick up. Try to slightly arch your back. Look up to the ceiling. If it's uncomfortable, try to stabilize your neck. Five more seconds. Four, three, two, one, and switch side. Keep it up. Five more seconds. Four, three, two, one. Good job. Woo. We're gonna sit on the heels, hands behind. We're gonna do a gent passive stretch on the ankle, yeah. So slowly bring up your knee in the air. Feel the weight on the heels, the front side. Nice and easy and move your hip side to side. Just adjust your weight. As we train pole dancers, we sometimes use the pointed toes. So I would suggest to do passive stretch on the mat. So bring your feet on the floor and then bring your knees to the circle. So just a slight gentle massage against the floor. Some people feeling extreme tension but some people don't. So each, each body feels different, that's normal. All right, and another way. So bring your toes. And then one more time, circling around. Feels good, no? Nice. Yeah. So. Then switch side. So this movement you can do whenever you feel like. It doesn't matter when you're watching a Netflix or TV or listening music at home. You can do anytime, anywhere. So then flip your foot. And one more time, circling around. Very good. And it's slowly coming way out. Then open your feet either side. We're gonna move on to the side stretching. Exhale, inhale, coming back. Exhale. Then bring forward. Close your elbow and slowly come up. Let's do five more times. Two, to the side, come back in the center. Three, to the side, to the side. And then to the front. And four. To the side, come forward, and a five, last one, look up to the ceiling, then in the middle, Whew. then close your feet, feeling nice stretching and opening up my body, yeah, I don't know, how are you feeling? Let me know in the comment, so the next one, 
We are going to extend both hands to the top of the mat and then bring your chest slowly down to the floor. Look up forward. You can move your hips side to side if you want to or just a static hold as you like. You can close your eyes and bring your inner word. Focus on the breathing. Each breath helps you to sinking down your chest to the floor. All right, slowly coming away out. So, thank you so much for working out with me, Ellie, and you are joining this class. I hope this video helps you to energize the pole training next few hours or 30 minutes, I don't know. So let me know in the comment section if you like this kind of video, I would like to upload weekly pole dance related videos. So check this out previous video if you haven't checked yet. See you later. Ciao.